what up what up what up what up crypto warriors and sergeant crypto back at it again today is thursday february 21st 2019 um wanted to make a video in regards to the deficit or the budget crisis for retirees and i know on uh, multiple occasions i have pointed out the fact that we as a nation are in you know debt up to 22 trillion dollars and counting and there is no real way to solve it but there's also another issue with uh 210 trillion dollar deficit for entitlements meaning medicaid and um social security right meaning that people won't be able to get their so-called entitlements um, in the future. All right, uh, I'm trying to get some good lighting here. And yeah, so this article, you know, points out the fact that there will be a two hundred ten trillion dollar deficit for. Um, entitlements and they have no way of paying it you know the way how the system is set up is you pay into it right and you're supposed to get um, what's owed to you it's basically your money all right there was even a Supreme Court case back in 1960 where someone tried to say that okay um, we shouldn't have to pay into it you know and then the Supreme Court stated well no it's it's not property and um, you are obligated as a citizen to pay into the system. However, the uh, Congress isn't obligated to pay us from the system, right? I mean, right now they're keeping their promises and paying a lot of retirees, okay? Uh, but in the near future, we could come to a point where either um, the people that are already retired have to go back to work because they say they'll they'll say all right we are going to extend the, the retirement age and or come back and say that you know people younger you know in their 50s 40s and all you know millennials all these people will have to um extend their retirement age to no longer be in uh, what is it now 68 I think or 60, 65 but um, to something like 72 or 75 because people are living longer man all right people aren't um, living into their 70s anymore people are living well into their 90s you know we have some centurions centurions as well so people are living longer and we have no way of uh, taking care of them financially okay or even um, on the medical front you know, uh, we don't have the funds to, to pay for it. So, this is why I encourage, again, not a financial advice, but this is why I think cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin was invented to help and give us a, um, not an upper hand, but a fair shake, so to speak. And, um, the ones that need to be taken advantage of uh, Bitcoin and cryptos are not. You know, they are doing, they're allowing right now Wall Street, the same people that Bitcoin was invented to, to go against to get into, into Bitcoin and crypto right now and allowing them to, you know, eat it all up. Meanwhile, the people that need, that need crypto, all right, aren't taking advantage of it right now and we'll just have more of the same where people will be complaining that oh the rich are getting richer it's because we didn't take advantage of the fact that something like bitcoin exists and we need to um, be taking advantage of it as far as um buying trading hodling whatever the case is all right um, increasing your bag so to speak uh, because we're the ones that it was invented for, not the you know fact that Wall Street types, but they're the, they're the ones that's buying it all up right now. So, yeah, man, let me know what you guys think. I'm going to leave a link again, as always, to the article in the description below. 
And it's your boy, Sergeant Crypto, and I'm out. Peace.